all right guys quick video so we broke down and I'm up here at Freightliner broke down having transmission issues and I decided I was trying to figure out you know where I want to take the truck to get fits uh, now I don't recommend this to y'all of course but me I'm going to Freightliner this Freightliner said they can fix it tomorrow. Oh, so what am I having? Nothing's actually wrong with the actual transmission, but the stick here is completely uh, loose. So it's a ton of play in it. I can't go into any upper gear whatsoever because this is all neutral. You see, I'm up here. I'm still in neutral. See, it's still in neutral. Still in all the way back here. I'm still in neutral. Down there, damn near about a seat belt is the gear to take it out of gear, you see I'm in gear look at this, to take it out of gear look I got a right here now it's out of gear back in the neutral and then I can't go into any upper gear whatsoever, I can't, this is what this would be first I can't go in the first because it's too much play I can't even touch third so basically only the gears down here work so I had to drive it I had to go from 2nd gear to 4th gear, 4th gear to 6th gear, 6th gear to 8th. Uh, Bob turned all the way back. So, what the problem is, it's actually a bush right under here. It's going to cost about $18 to $30. It's actually connected to the bottom part of this stick. It's called the isolator. Isolator bushing um, on the shifter. If you Google it, you'll see it. It's just a... Um, it's just a bushing, they gotta replace the bushing. So this will come out, they'll take the stick out, the bottom part of the stick, and yeah, okay. I explained it good enough already. Other than that, man, do I got my wallet? Huh, see if I need them to do something else while I'm over here. I know what y'all thinking, Andrew. Get the AC fits. Nope, not no, nope, nah, hell no. Not at no two hundred something dollars an hour. Oh no. Oh no no no. I got other mechanics that can do that. Let's see if I can show y'all that bush, you know. Oh shit, we got the exhaust pipe right here. Maybe I can see it. Let me see. Top part of the transmission right there, that pin gonna have to come out. See it follows the stick upwards. So in fact that may just be the bushing right there. But I think it's actually in that piece right there. But anyways, they're gonna take that stick off, place that freight line said they get to me in about 48 hours. I said okay, cool. I come here, drop the truck off here flat top up the road, the blue truck up the road it's not a problem oh and I'm at the house too so that's another reason why I'm actually at the house but down the street from the house, I'm in Nashville so I go ahead and pay the bill how much is it going to run, the parts are cheap I don't know what they're going to charge in labor, I just know it's about 200 hours so we're going to say minimum a thousand dollars because they just got to get you I go up in there. I need to go and see if some work being done for $200 an hour. Woo! $200 an hour, so sure ain't nobody working. Y'all see that? That don't look too good. $200 an hour, ain't nobody working. <laughs> You had to go up in here. $200 an hour. I don't see nobody doing no work up in there. Hell is going on.
Ticket rolled up, too much play in the shift. It can only shift in the downwards motion. Transmission is re -man, re man all the gears work. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and park it. Leave it here. Y'all see the hourly rate 204, right? Ain't nobody working. So right now we in the uh, second gear. Let's get out to this, I'll have to shift the fourth. Then go into the high range, go from fourth to sixth. So basically you'll have to rev the RPMs up to about 2,000. And that'll allow you to, uh, that'll allow you to, uh, man, I don't know, like this fit over now, hold on now. I can bust a U-turn. That'll allow you to jump, jump from one gear to uh, skip a gear, you know. You can skip a gear that way. Like I said, I don't recommend y'all paying 200 an hour. There was another mechanic over at Lebanon that was uh that could work on it for me. Oh, you know what? I don't even think I got reverse. Uh oh. Let's try to find out. They got a forklift out here. Fuck you talking about. I think they can get out that little gate right there. They're they gonna be alright. My, my bad. I ain't know I ain't had no reverse. That way, I ain't find that out to just now. Thank you. 